So you want to be a professional Android app developer and start publishing your own apps? You came to the right place. Hello, my friends, and welcome to our new Mastering Android App Development with Kotlin course. This course will take you from absolutely zero to Android hero. If this is your first time here, hit subscribe and activate the bell to get the latest tutorials. Also, you are invited to join our Telegram channel to get latest updates. Now, let's start building professional Android applications. Hello, my friends. In this video, we're going to download and install Android Studio with the latest SDK configurations. So, Android Studio is an integrated development environment for Android app development. Let's go to Android. Uh, developer.android.com slash studio and you can get the Android Studio by clicking on this download button. You can scroll down, have agree and install for Windows. It's about 940 uh, mega. Click on start download and let's start downloading it. These are some new features that are added to the Android Studio Electric app. You can read it about it. If you want to have different platform like uh, Mac OS, Linux, Chrome OS, you can download these from the platforms here. Okay. So if you have Linux, you can scroll down and click on this. It's about one gigabyte. Then open the installer. And you'll get the Android Studio setup. Click on Next. Select the Android virtual device and tick it. Click Next and click on Install. After finishing, click Next and start Android Studio. And this is the Android Studio Setup Wizard that telling us that the, there is no SDK, no Android SDK found. Click on Next. Here we have the latest SDK. Android SDK is about 400 megabyte. So what is SDK? SDK is the collection of Android platform APIs, tools, and utilities that enable you to debug, profile, and compile your applications. We need to set up and make sure that through our uh, programming uh, process and the programming career that we have the latest SDK and Android APIs. Click Next, Next, and click Accept to install these extensions and plugins and click Finish. And wait for Android Studio to set up and uh, download the, the necessary components. Then click on Finish. And this is our Android Studio welcome screen. We have here the projects, customize, plugins, and learn Android Studio tabs. The projects that allows us to create a new project, open project, existing project, and get from the version control from GitHub. Or we have the more actions button. We have the SDK manager, virtual device manager, import code, import project, and profile or debug. If you want to master Android app development in both the Java and Kotlin languages, learn Java from zero and learn Kotlin from scratch, master data structure and algorithms in C and Java, join my Udemy bestseller courses to start publishing your own apps. Get the coupons from the description below. But we are interested in using the new project now. And the customize, we can customize the color and the theme of our uh, Android Studio. We can select IntelliJ Lite, Dracula, High Contrast, and we can download other uh, themes later on. But I prefer using the Dracula. Plugins, we can download and search here in the tab 
for uh, for example like Kotlin or other uh, plugins, JSON to Kotlin and so on. Later on, we will use these plugins in details and use some of them in a very, uh, very high and very important uh, uh, roles. Learn and Studio can get these are the referee referrals of for the tutorials. Now, all we want to make here, make sure that our SDK is, uh, is correctly installed. We can see the platforms. SDK tools and update sites. We can see that we can uh, have an update here available. We can tick on it and click on apply and we download the latest uh, build tools. Okay. So make sure you have the latest SDK tools. Now let's move to the, for, for creating the new project, select empty activity. We can select from a bunch, uh, bunch of activities, uh, but I prefer using the empty activity for beginners. Now let's name the project. I'll name it as first app and the package name. You can select the, the package name, the com.mastercoding, for example. Um, it's good. The save location. The language you need java or kotlin for our course we'll use the kotlin and the minimum sdk selected 24. click finish and let's uh, build the project and keep uh, uh, keep android studio working uh, to sync and build the files for the first time then click finish and android studio will start building the files here and wait for everything to be completed here and congratulations guys this is our android studio this is a very very amazing software we're gonna uh, learn and master how to use it and to build professional android applications in the next video we're gonna configure the emulator and run the existing and the first application we have in our Android Studio.